Oh, hello, friends. How's it going? This is Jeff playing Ultimate Admiral, Age of Sail, American Campaign. Now, as you can see... I added a 144-gun ship. It's a fair haven. Now, I can only put three upgrades on her. Like, I got a lot of money because I... I went over here and all the ships that I had uh, taken, like like these 32 uh, right here, you know, I just, uh, you know, just sell them. These are the default guns on the ships that I take off and I can sell them. I can make 20 grand right there. I keep these because I like these. But what I did on this ship was I put these because I had these, so I put these on here. I didn't have to buy them, but I bought these. I still got these on here because I only have four rep and I can't buy any more. Like I don't think I have anything else that could go there that I have. Yeah, I don't have enough of anything. So I don't have any more rep. But notice I have a lot of money now because, you know, I sold off all those ships and all those guns. So the next battle is uh, Whitehaven, the raid. Uh, we get... Get 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 a good bit of money, so let's go ahead and do that. But this is a land battle, so I stocked up my uh, ships, and I got those ready. So, anyways, we have two transports, and then we have uh, the Fairhaven, which is the new 144 gun ship. And we have the Hancock, which we already had, a 144-gun ship. And the only sh other ship I prepared was Dover, which was the new 126-gun ship that I a a get got into my fleet. Then everybody else is minimized. So we got a little about 4450. All right, I remember this one. I think this is a fun one, right? I think... But this is a very long battle. Got those big mountains. All right, and, oh, and they give us some allies too. Here's the allies. Well, they give us one, two, three, four, five allies. Nice. So you guys get moving. Yeah, I don't know. Let's let's just get everybody moving. Come on, boys, get moving. It's just too many units. My goodness. Let's go a little faster, boys. Get everybody moving. All right. Oh, this is my mortar. I guess the mortar could go there. All right, we've got to slow down now, get back to normal speed now that we see the enemy. Don't stop. Everybody keep going. Come on. All right. Here's my artillery. 
So I guess I'll get the artillery here too. I can't remember, but sometimes they have... We're just going to block this off. But everybody else got to keep on moving. Okay, now they show their colors. Let's go get them. And we still need a bunch over here. Oh yeah, right up here, right up there. We gotta go get that gun. Okay, you stop, you over there, engage. All right, we gotta, all right, you two have gotta go over here then. These units will have to come up and get the gun. Come on. So I wonder why he backed off. Why is he backing off? Why are they backing off? Man. I have never seen them back off like this. Never. They usually plant themselves and attack. Guess maybe that's what they do on easy, but still. This is with scaling, but... Hmm. Alright, look. Okay, look, if he if he's going to keep backing off, then I need both of you to shoot at him. And it doesn't look like... Let's make sure we get everybody. Man, I gotta keep moving forward here. Hey, he, he got off the gun. Nice. Shoot him. We don't like skirmishers. And they keep withdrawing. Well, I guess all we can do is push him, right? And that means I gotta get my, my guns moving. My guns ain't even having a chance to shoot because they keep they keep going away.
Man. Yeah, I've never, like I said, I've never seen them with a the draw so quickly. Alright, well, we know they got enemy over here. Oh, wow, I even got these guys over here. And they keep withdrawing. All right, look, he's going to try to get behind us. Okay, well, what I'm sending these guys around here, like, I know there's a couple of infantry and uh, artillery up here. It's shattered. All right, so can we... Yeah, can we just block them totally off? Yeah, because we do not like skirmishers. We definitely want to kill them. Yeah, look how one skirmish unit can 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 hold back your whole force. I know I complained about that in the other battle that I did. This one unit is holding five units from advancing.
All right. I wonder if they can come this way. Probably not because of the rocks. So I think these guys are just going to hold the line for now till we work on the other stuff. All right, we got this got this raging battle going on here. Shoot that gun. You, my friend, shoot that gun. We want the gun. Pike over here. Peter over there. So we'll get that gun shortly. But guys, you gotta you gotta constantly be moving forward, boys. Okay, so skirmish is shattered. We just gotta wait. F we gotta wait till he shatters too. I mean, I could probably try to charge him and capture him, but I got enough prisoners in the harbor that they didn't even buy yet. So, not gonna worry about it. No. Is there anybody beat up? Nope. Alright, we're just trying to hold off a little bit because we don't want their guns to start hitting us. And we got this gun now. We can start going forward like... We want to come over this way. And like I said, it's too bad that um, artillery doesn't get experience anymore. I wish they, I, I wish they could hurry up and fix that. So disappointing playing a campaign where three units won't gain any XP. Like, you know what I mean? All right, well, these guys want to stop us, so let's go ahead and, um... Let's not put up with that. All right, well, you know, Gallant 
Dodge him. Just get him over with. Can't believe he's just... Just like this one, he's... he's um. Because he knows that if if we get over here, we're going to get pounded by their artillery. And I come over here to try to avoid most of it. Now, of course, I like. I don't know if did you. I don't know if you saw a message saying that he got wiped out. I have no idea. But if I if I try to come over here, I'm going to get hit by artillery too. So I think I can leave these guys here for now until I need them later. And you, why don't you just go shoot him? I mean, that's annoying. All right. Now let's get him off the hill. It's like he's just holding this position. Because if we go over here, we're going to get hit by their artillery somehow. If he doesn't want to engage us, we don't care. Because once I get this artillery right here, I can have I can shoot that at him. Uh, see, so they must be hitting us. Yeah, cause I see some artillery right here. Alright, let's get over here. Like I said, we don't want to get hit by their artillery. Wait, they they seem to want to engage us in some areas, but I don't know. Let me see. If if he wants to engage, then I'll have these two allies shoot at him along with me. As a matter of fact, uh, what is this? This mortar can go right here. And this gun can go right here. Oh, yeah, and we got, got some stuff going on over here. Hold on.
Yeah, see, when you break off skirmishes, one shot from artillery kills them. So it's, it's you know, like so. So we just lost 37 and 37. I mean, that was, that was that fast. So I, I'm not a big believer of breaking off skirmishes. In this game, like skirmishes in Ultimate General could last a while, but not not here. This 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 one. These guys get wiped out big time. But all we care about is knocking out the gun. We're getting hit by another gun, but, they, but we can't see. So now you guys over here and find the gun. No! Gotta find the gun. All right, so this is gonna be the fight for the hill. And we still got this fight going on here. Oh, there. We gotta get a little help for you, so you can send those guys over there. Alright, I thought I had a unit that only had, um, oh, 88. Alright, over here. Oh, you gotta get the guns up here. And I think I can put the mortar up here too. go grab this gun you get up here to protect it oh somebody's killed Okay, got a lot going on here. All right, so Beckett's down to 96, so we're gonna get him over here. And you're down to 87, you're down to 98. Come on, Pike, come on, let's go.
All right, well, let's see. You see, if these guys just hold their position, the gun can work on those units, but you guys got to hold your positions. You can't keep following them. And now we don't know what happened to that unit over there, but we're going to come over here now and engage. Oh, look, he's still there. He is still there. Oh. Wow. He is still there. <laughs> so. <laughs> he is still here. So I am going to try to kill him off right now. Hey, a supply crew is shattered. Get over here. I didn't even know a supply wagon was over here. Excellent. Like, I hope it's not destroyed by the artillery. I wonder how it got, how it got shattered. All right, wait, we gotta get guns to shoot at that gun. Oh, and we got somebody over here too. All right, now I don't know if this one got destroyed because man, there are so many battles going on right now. Hey, Lee, over here. All right, look, we need the um, artillery. We need the artillery over here. All right, you go after him. You go after him. You go after him. You should be hitting him. You should be hitting him. I need you over here. Need you over here. Need you over here. Let's go. Hey, shoot the gun. They might have a gun over here too, I guess, because this gun shouldn't be shooting at them because, you know, so then I want you over here. You got to go find that artillery. <laughs> All right, guys, it's time to just charge. Yep, there it is. It's up to you, Davis and Pike. Get over there and get that. All right, fall back, guys. Fall back. Fall back.
Oh my god, he is still there. I so now I have to <laughs> I cannot believe this. I cannot believe it. You just kill this one unit. Oh, where's that artillery unit? No. There he is, right there. Shoot him. Yeah, because we want this supply wagon, right? This supply. Now the question is, yeah, I can get the supply wagon. Nice. All right. We'll get the supply wagon over here too so we can fill up. All right, my unit needs to be killed in this, this here. You need to kill him. You go over there and get ammo. The guns have got to come down here to get ammo. All the guns. All the small units. I want these units to be together. Davis, you can come over here and... Oh, well, no, Davis, get over here and help him. Now, I don't know, I still don't know if we killed that unit. So we're gonna have to come over here. Hey, where are you going? You stop. Stop merging units because this is um, we have too many small units. All right, look, you shoot him, please. You've got to kill this unit right here. 
Please kill him. All right, we finally shattered the artillery. Now it's just a matter of trying to wipe out these units. What the heck? How did this unit get past me? And he's over there trying to kill off my unit. See, they'll do anything they can to try to disrupt your units, man. I am not good at you. So now I gotta send me up here. Oh, that was a supply wagon, too, by the way. I gotta get back on the supply wagon. So I want to fill it up. And we got a gun right here that we can take. Guys, are we just sitting on these guys? Let's go fight them. Okay, well, I don't, like I said, this is a crazy battle. I don't know what to tell you, folks. But I don't like units behind me, and, and I don't know what happened to them. So, you guys get over here. We got to kill who we see. Whoever we don't see, you know, I'll have to put some people here to protect this place. So, I'll leave a gun. Maybe two guns. Yeah, all right, well, we, we've taken some losses, that's for sure. Now, again, we don't know what's over there, so... I think everybody's gonna... Oh, yeah, we still got this guy right here. Well, this unit here, Davis, has to go get ammo.
All right, so these units don't need ammo, so they're going to go right here and make a line. I'll take Pike. He doesn't even need ammo either, so I'll have Pike grab this. So we captured pretty much all their weapons, I believe. I mean, I hope so. And I didn't know, but we did capture one supply wagon, too. That was nice. Uh, you two need ammo. You don't need ammo, so you can get over there. You don't need ammo, so you can get over there. You don't need ammo, you can get over there. You don't need ammo, so you can get moving. You can get moving. You can get moving. Now, we got that uh, straggler over there. Yeah, and he's still... He's still shooting at this guy, but he I don't know if he shot back. Oh, he's over... Wait a minute. Yeah, honestly, I don't think we have to go chase them. I think if I put all the small units here... So if I leave my gun here, seeing he ain't going to earn XP anyway, like none of these guns do, so that's kind of sucks, but I think everybody else can move. All the big units. All right, so if I put a unit right there, Put me right here. All right, so this is the final phase of this, so... My mortar can go right there, I guess. Davis, get going. And we're going to see if we can get this supply wagon full before this runs out. It's only at Because if he thinks he's going to take this back, no way. <laughs> so if I leave the mortar and the gun, my guns, my, my two guns. And we got this one too. Like, no, that's mine. So what is this one? Well, this is one we picked up, so that's okay. Stick him like that. So that'll take care of that. So now we can just approach the city, I guess. We just got to go get that, I mean... Like I said, I probably don't even need the guns, but... Um, they're only going to probably have a couple and any of the stragglers that ran away. And so I think by doing this, I don't think that they can come here because uh, the guns will hit them. Just like as if I was going to make this approach. So yeah.
And we got a few prisoners. And like I said, I'm trying to fill this up. So I only got 24%. But okay, so now we can engage. Alright, let's come in here, boys. Come on, let's go get it. Come on, Davis. Oh, and I didn't even use these. <laughs> hey, and we're still shooting at this unit, another unit over here. Now, this is a bigger unit. Yeah, but I, like I said, he, he can't really approach. Because the gun keeps hitting him. Yeah, and I think I'm not going to get this supply wagon full. Because the artillery is eating up the... Uh, Well, I, what I could do is shut them off. Yeah, 
Yeah, that way the supply wagon will fill up. And then they'll come a little bit closer, and then I'll have this unit go here, and I'll have Peter come here. Me right there, and you right there. I mean, he ought to see all these units here and, and not want to engage. So we got 16% here and uh, what happened? Yeah, because if this unit here got, dies, uh, like I probably should withdraw. Because if I don't keep a unit alive, I won't be able to fill the supply wagon. I probably ain't going to be able to fill it anyway, so I'm not going to worry about it. We'll try to get what we can get out of this right here. Come on, boys. Yeah, wherever he goes, he's going to run into my guys. Alright, well we got the town and we don't have a supply depot here, so that kind of bites. Okay, so now I'm just going to hit uh, fast speed and hope he doesn't kill himself off. Okay, so it went down a percentage, so we're just going to see. I only found one, one supply wagon. If there's more, I don't know. I didn't even know there was a supply wagon until... It said it was wiped out over here. I'm glad I saw the message and, and I was able to claim it. But we're right about here and the game is going as fast as it can. So just speed to the end. I'm going to see if I can fill it up. It is 16.15 at the moment. So it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And we know there's one unit running around somewhere. We got some prisoners, so we'll put the prisoners in there. I'll shut the guns off. Because the guns would shoot at an enemy if they see it. And that might kill the only uh, enemy. Now, why can't I select this? Oh. Alright, so I got the guns off.
Hey, look, we're down to 9%. We were at like, what were, were we at like 14 or something? So yeah, this is filling up. And it's only 1640. I mean, I, I think I'm going fast, right? Yeah, four times the game speed. Yeah, so just go to the end if you want to see it, as always. Like, nobody watches my whole video anyway, so just skip to whatever it is you like to see. And all I'm going to say is, I'll just talk about that. I'm, 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 I just hope someday that they're going to not walk away from the game and they're going to fix fix a, like a supply wagon unit like whatever their stats are they're not gonna it's not gonna change and definitely artillery and mortar we can't get back these perks so they're 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 gone and and he'll be this like he'll be whatever he is i mean it's takes the fun out of like trying to groom a unit into being a three-star unit you know what I mean it takes the fun away imagine if I had a nice three-star artillery unit man it'd be so much fun and I don't care about killing that unit off I mean the moment this is empty I'll end the uh, thing and see, and we're not full yet, but at least we're over 5,000. So we must be around like around 7,000 right now. Yeah, that just dropped another percentage. Okay, so now it's 17. So we started this around 16, what was it, what was it like around 1620? So that's only one game hour of in-game time and it just lost another percent. So within not even two game hours, this dropped several percent. It's just one more percent. And it's zero. All right. It's zero, so I'll end. I'm going to take a guess that it's around 8,000. All right, well, we know it's a victory. Okay, so, I mean, this is a, you know, like I said, I did this on hard, and it, it was it was harder because they didn't run away, so they, they charged more and stuff. But it was still a little challenging because, like I said, if you don't have a good line here, I was getting chewed up over here because of that artillery that was over here. So, yeah. So I did lose a 1,000. And army strength was this. I mean, they gave us a lot of allies. That is nice. And they lost this much. They had 18 guns, and they lost all 18 guns. And we have about 300 prisoners. I didn't know that. Hold the farm in town. All right, so according to this, yeah, according to this, it looks like they only had one supply wagon, so I got it. You know, like, and I didn't even know they had it, to be honest. Like, uh, like I said, when I got that message that they got destroyed, I got it. So, yeah, happy about that. And we got one wounded, so he don't get no, he won't get any XP if that was my guy. I don't know if it was. And we got eighteen of these, which I can sell and make a lot of money. And and we didn't, yeah, we got we didn't get to eight, but we got to seven thousand five hundred. So yeah, because this this supply wagon only had like maybe one third of what it had, so we just put another two thirds into it, or or maybe two quarters into it, you know, that, that's not bad. I got 1,700 of these. So, all right. Tell me what you think, folks.
Oh, lost the captain. So the Hancock didn't lose much from that battle. This one wasn't in it. This one wasn't in it. And this one wasn't in it. So Fairhaven, she didn't lose that much. Dover didn't lose that much. And my transports. Yeah, see, no perks. Same stats. Lost the perks a long time ago when I made this. Never got them back. And they never get beyond this. I mean, this, this really sucks. I mean, and it's been like this for a very long time. And as I said before, it takes all the fun of trying to groom a unit and get get the three get the three perks. These are all disabled. Because when you because I mean I had him at the 80s and 60s with all three perks. He went into the battle and they were all gone. So enough said. Yeah, I don't need to make any changes. And look at this now, how much money I got because I've been selling all those ships and all the guns and stuff. Like I got a lot of money, but the, here's where, the, where it hurts now, so I used up a lot of rep. All right, I'm going to drop one in here for officer survival. So maybe that'll help. And Man of War comes up next. That's five ships, so... The question is, should... I might as well make one more fire ship, right? And I need five five ships, so if I bring in Oh, Jersey already has people on here in the Connecticut. Okay. Call this one Fire 10. And I can put 252 on. Alright, so that's ship number one. So we'll definitely want our 144 gunships.
Well, because I have a lot of money, I, I think I can stop putting on upgrades. Let's go with let's go with uh, advanced cut in sales. All right, and you know I'm gonna buy I'm gonna buy this. It's gonna take away seven of my rep. That's the next upgrade that I'm gonna want right here. Low, look how how much that lowered the weight. And then that means I can put on a structure repair kit and a boarding kit. Now let's see how much personnel we can put on. I can get to a thousand. All right, so I have Dover, I have Fairhaven. Oh, now the Hancock. It's going to cost 10000 So we have the Hancock. All right, so one, two, three, four, so I still need one more though, right? Yeah, I'm sorry that I'm doing this, but I gotta make sure you have five ships. All right, so one of these I have to make. I guess it ain't going to matter because they all just have that. So this is probably going to be real expensive. Yeah, because New York, Rochester, Fall River. Yeah. Okay, well, you know what? Um, that's a big investment for this, but but look at the stats. I mean, that's thirty four thousand. But I got the money that I, so it's not like I want to burn it. But I think I'm going to do that. That's very expensive. Okay, so as you can see, I put four upgrades on this ship. But, would, I definitely spent a lot of money. And I have the amount of ships, so I think that will be that. All right.
Alright, I think I have my five ships ready for the next battle. So, anyways, um, yeah, you can see how this game is, you know, it's easy, but it, it can get tough at times with scaling. So, anyways, no matter where you are in the world, have a great day, a great afternoon, or a great evening. Take care of yourself, be kind to each other. This is Jeff signing out. Adios, amigos.